how did that person wake up and find the door out of the bedroom in the morning? These are the people that are driving 6,000 pound weapons. They don't realize it. Yes, they're idiots. And they're out there, so you gotta be aware. Oh, this is so tempting. Uh, the car behind me is also wanting to go. Oh, they're playing with me. I'm tempted. Should I, should I not? No cops. Why not? <laughs> That's pretty much full out open. Yeah, it's just that was probably in fourth gear. <laughs> gotta have fun sometimes, right? <laughs> That's what it's about, as long as it's safe. As long as there's no cops. Notice how you can't see my speedometer? You gotta protect yourself. You never know who's watching. Yeah, it sounded like I was going fast. Yeah, it looked like I was going fast. But how fast was I going? I just don't know. <laughs> oh man. I'm usually doing a speed limit. I honestly I can't it's not even the cost of the ticket, I just don't wanna get the hit with the demerit points. You know, having a car and a bike insurance is gonna go up come renewal time and sacrifice something. I'm not one to sacrifice anything. <laughs> anyway, so just coming along the, the nice road that I like to go down. It's got a couple of nice bends, but you now I usually when I do ride twisties, when I ride with people, you know, I have a comfort level that I like riding in. Generally I'm gonna say it's gonna be between I'm gonna say it's around 75% of what I feel comfortable with at my skill level. Um, obviously, you know, just there's so many factors you can't predict. You know, you may have to adjust your line. You may have to avoid an oncoming vehicle. You may have to, you know, do something. And if you're riding at 100%, you're scraping peg through every turn. Yes, gotta love those signs. Um, you just you have no room correct. So, you just gotta be safe. You have to predict the unpredictable. And you just, you know, gotta take it easy. There's just been too many people that have gone down this season. And uh, I don't want to be one of them. Uh, honestly, I've about eight, eight to ten riders that I know have gone down. You know, some of them have, you know, messed up their knees. Some of them have totaled their bikes. Another rider there enjoying his twisties. Actually, I think that was my buddy. Eh, whatever. Anyway, you guys, you just gotta... You gotta... Holy shit, man, I hate those tracks. You gotta be careful out there. You know, if you're always riding hard, you're asking for it. Well, I'm just gonna chill here and wait for that car to pass by. Take it easy. Stretch a little bit. Oh. getting a bike, if you're just going to be getting a bike right off the bat, you've never been on them before, start off small, you know, you have the, the lower seat height, it's a lighter bike, it's much more forgiving, and you are going to be a hooligan when you first get a bike, I'm 25, and even when I got my 250, I'm a very responsible person, like I, I'm sluggish, <laughs> you know, I, I'm always, you know, telling everyone to ride safe, telling everyone to wear their gear, um, I'm always trying to stay within the speed limit most of the time. I'm always leaving responsible distance with you know the rider or the car in front of me because you never know what's gonna happen. Alright, I think we did enough waiting here. <laughs> time to enjoy the twist days. Uh, looks like they're learning to drive a fire truck. Hopefully they don't call their friends when I go back and forth through the streets. <laughs> Gotta, you gotta be safe. No, it's just some black SUV. Whenever I see a black SUV, I get nervous because you know, in my car I've been rear-ended so many times. Yeah. Twisty roads ahead. There's, there's a hidden driveway here for some kind of country club or golf club. So there's all these people pulling in and pulling out of there and they don't stop. You know? Usually these rich people, they're they don't care. You'll stop for them. I've had unknown animals run across the street here. I've had people pull out of that country club right over there. There's someone turning in. I'm surprised.
tried to actually signal and slow down. Um, but yeah, you gotta take it easy. Right from your comfort level. Be safe. If you wanna end up dragging me and screaming pegs, take it to the track. Controlled environment is closed. You know, if something happens, you have paramedics on site. If you're gonna drop a bike and slide, you're gonna slide the grass or dirt. Careful guys, cool crazy chaos saying bye for now.